Hello everyone. Let's try to solve this question from the chapter light based on the concept refractive index. Let's go through the question and try to understand what is given and what we need to find out. A monochromatic ray of light passes from air to glass. Monochromatic means it is having only light rays of one wavelength. Now the wavelength of light in air is lambda. So wavelength of light in air is is equal to lambda. The speed of light in air is speed of light in air is c and speed of light in glass is v. If the absolute refractive index of glass is 1.5 so he gave you absolute refractive index which is nothing but refractive index of glass with respect to air or vacuum both are same is equal to 1.5 what we need to find out the relationship between C and V and also the wavelength of light in glass. Let's consider first question. We need to find out relationship between C and V. We already know that refractive index of first medium with respect to second medium is equal to speed of light in second medium by speed of light in first medium. Now considering this and also this value rga is equal to 1.5 we can write down that this will be equal to speed of light in air by speed of light in glass which is equal to substitute these values c by speed in glass is nothing but v which is equal to rga which is 1.5 when we consider this we will get c is equal to 3 by 2 into v now let's take this equation to be 1 now let's go through the b part what is b part the wavelength of light in glass before answering this question let's try to understand one simple point we know that frequency is equal to speed by wavelength now since source is not changing frequency will remain constant here so speed will be directly proportional to wavelength considering this equation we can write down that speed of light in air by speed of light in glass will be equal to wavelength in air by wavelength in glass which we need to find out we need to find out wavelength in glass we know wavelength in air which is lambda and speed in air and also speed in glass let's try to substitute these values speed in air is c by speed in glass will be 2 by 3 c right from this equation we can write it as 2 by 3 into c will be equal to lambda in air will be lambda by lambda in glass is unknown which we need to find out you can clearly see that we can cancel down this c and this c and if you try to solve this you will get lambda in glass will be equal to 2 by 3 lambda wavelength of light in glass will be 2 by 3 lambda 